that was a loud one. I'm gonna leave the clapping now. I've started talking about it. <laughs> the, the, the beginning of most videos. Not to sync audio because the microphone go plugs straight into the camera, so I don't have that problem. But I generally, cl I generally clap a lot in videos, mostly just for cut points. But <laughs> I'm leaving that one in because that one, that one sounded quite loud and vibrant. I don't know if that's gonna pick up. <laughs> Anyway, welcome back to Day of the Day. We've got some more days for your day. There might be some background noise outside, I'm not sure. But I've brought it up just in case there is. We've got three days today. We've got a food day, a day that I already need to start, a day that brings up something that I kind of want to talk about now I think about it. And another day that I'm going to have to think about what I want to say for. But it might be a bit. So let's start with the food day. The food day is National Empanadas Day. It's one of... I can't... There's so many different Mexican foods that I don't really know the difference between all of them. I think I might have done empanadas before. Empanadas are the ones with the the the, the wraps you do them and you've got sauce and cheese on the out, all on the outside and it's a bugger and a mess to eat but it's kind of, still kind of good. Yeah, it's alright. Mexican food in general is pretty good. National Zoo Lovers Day. Um, that's, that's the one that I think. Because I, I... People I watch on YouTube who more regular depending on what I have plans for it, it is uh, the Disney food blog which is why it's depending on how much plans I have for going away to a well one of the American Disney's at least anytime soon in this case the video today was things that are still happening and it, it, it even though the parks are closed and it made me think and it made me realize yeah no there's people like that like that's one of those things you don't immediately think when people go essential businesses but yeah zookeepers and in the case of disney the people that look after the animals in animal kingdom they're all still active they're still working they're still doing jobs to you know their job to look after these creatures which is which is fucking fantastic i think i think i'd like it i don't know if it, again it's one of those things that lovers is a bit of an extreme like, I like going to the zoo. The zoo's fun. It's nice, you know, hanging out with people. My favorite thing to do with the zoo is, and and same goes with aquariums, is just give various animals voices. Just great dialogue that doesn't actually exist, because it's that's always fun. I mean, I don't know, maybe sometimes when we go, well, sometime when we go, I'll do, uh, I'll film some stuff and do that actually as a video, because I think that might be funny. But yeah, no, I like the zoo. don't know if I'd call myself a lover of zoos, because I don't know. Seems a bit, seems a bit much. I don't think I'm that committal to Zeus. Our final day today is National All Is Ours Day. All, everything the light it touches, which is actually kind of poignant because it's very much the actual, the actual, actual thing behind the day is uh, the beauty of nature and all that, which ties very nicely into the beautiful, beautiful people that are working to look after all of these zoo animals and such during these awkward fucking times but i also just like the the phrasing all is ours this this is ours this is our world this is our fucking world it's our world to change yeah no pull, pulled it in that's all right as i was spinning around i thought i could do that yes this world is ours especially as a god this world is very much ours or very much mine but yes, I think I think we should do some stuff with it. Hence why that's the goal. But we'll get there. We'll get there. This world is ours to do with as we please. To change, to be better, to remove those that do not serve it. To add those to add to what there already is. To grow and improve and generally just have a better fucking time of the of it all. Let, let let us strive forward into the new age, because I think the one we're in currently is slowly coming to an end. I mean, if the entirety of the beginning of this year is anything to go by, I don't think we're in whatever we were before. I like people calling it the Roaring Twenties again, because it implies there's going to be a big, it implies a lot of party and a lot of fun, and I like that. I like that a lot. But those were your days for today. Um, I'm still in chair. I still have sore foot. It uh, it hurts a lot, <laughs> just randomly, well, constantly, but it changes level of pain at random. So I'm still in a chair, but using natural light, getting the filming done a little early. I don't know if I'm going to edit it yet, or if I'm going to wait till later, or well, much later, because D and D sessions. Saying it doesn't get cancelled. Uh, subscribe. 
subscribe. The, I would say more videos like this, but all these videos are different. Share these videos, share this video, share the playlist. Uh, we're getting close to that 100, so maybe, maybe think about catching up. It's like we're really close to that 100. And yes, th this is the series, this is Day of the Day, this is the series. Join, join the flock by doing the things I mentioned earlier. You know, the comments and the, the likes and all that are always very much appreciated. Embrace the chaos, the madness of the world. This is our world to make and form and bringing all back that. It's the chaos is the method and changing the world is the result. I will see all you fine kings and queens tomorrow.